Hi everyone, what's the story itself here? Okay, so I've just been and I've just got some non-alcoholic beer. The reason being is I don't actually drink um, anymore. Well, every so often I do, but because of me being on my medication, um, I've actually stopped because um, I didn't want it to interfere with the medication I was on. The medication I'm on now says doesn't actually say I can't drink, but I don't want to take that chance, take that risk. So I've got some non some alcohol free uh, lagers and stuff. This one is St Peter's um, without gold. Um, I've had an alcoholic lager before, like I've had Calibre, and I think it's um, there's another one I've had, something blue, which is really nice, and it does actually taste like lager. So I thought I'd see what these are like, if I can pop it in without knocking my camera over. And actually, it just it smells like lager. Um, and that, it that just comes in a bottle like lager. So I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> a minute. That was trying to start happening. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, we go. What I'll do is I normally I like lime in my lager, so I've got some lime cordial as well. And I'm gonna add try some without men, add some with the lime card add the lime cordial to it to what see what it's like. So it just smells like normal lager. That one's alright. It's very tasty. It's got a very. <laughs> it's got a very um, wheaty taste to it. Hey, John. Um, so, what I'll do now is I'll add some of the lime and see what that one's like. What it's like with lime. Like I say, it just tastes like normal lager, so I can't see if I'm being... That does actually improve the flavour. Um, it's quite... Like, one thing I find with lager is it's quite... It's got a weird taste to it. Um, even the non-alcoholic one, but the lime. It just gives it something. Um, so, yeah, that one is... That's... That was nice. I've also got, let's see in that, <laughs> um, Budweiser alcohol free. Um, so, let's see if we can get in. I said, I have tried some of the other ones before and they've been pretty nice. And again, what I'll do is I'll try a little bit without and then I'll add the lime to it see I can see what that's like with the lime that one actually it just smells like Budweiser I never make a good barmaid <laughs> Yeah, I've got a little bit too much head, <laughs> but it's actually more like um, a golden colour, um, this one. It's water, barley, malt, rice, malt extract, op, op extract, natural flavours, doesn't mean to say anything else about it. Uh, this one is... Again, doesn't really. Delicious golden alcohol free craft beer, which is a slightly sweet malt flavour combined with citrus bitterness, brewed with skill and presence in one of, the, one of Britain's finest small smallest breweries. So, let's just see what this sounds like now. That's 
really like Budweiser. Obviously, it's it made by Budweiser. But let's just add a little bit of lime now to you. I like the lime. That one, the Budweiser one's really smooth. I'm not surprised by that. Again, it's not as it's not as thing as um I'm trying to think of words. I don't want to say bitter because you've got bitter thing, but it's quite smooth and it's actually smoother than normal Heineken. Um, Heineken? Budweiser. Yeah, I just wanted to do um, a quick taste test of those too and see what it was like. Anyway, very quick video. Midnight's gone home. Uh, but I'm seeing like seeing her and Ali next week. So yeah. Anyway, for now I'm gonna say I love you lots, lots of chili tots and keeping looking weird. Bye.